Hello, friends. Lord Verminard, back again in my garage, and check it out. We actually have a garage now. This is exciting. So I think what we're going to do is earn some money because we need to... Are these empty? Yeah, these are empty. We need to earn some money to, um, to buy ourselves another race car. Because I sold the... I sold the, uh, the Neve because I was tired of fixing it after being wrecked about a million times. So, um, I guess we need to get some jobs in here and, uh, get some, get some stuff going. Um, I don't remember putting that there. Why is that there? I don't, I don't know. It'd be nice if that thing just would stand up, like, consistently, but it, it absolutely does not. And I'm going to move this thing... Uh, here-ish? That should work. Oh, you know what I wanted to do? Um, I wanted to grab... Well, I want to get rid of this barrel, because these things take up room and they don't do anything. I wanted to go over to the... to the shop over here. And... buy something. Oop. There's a... A builder's torch over here and I want to grab that and see if it makes seeing things easier I also sell traders, by the way. right they okay I wasn't sure the sound was working because it has been quiet there it is okay so I can just like I can just set that bad boy down I wonder it doesn't need batteries or anything well I guess we're gonna find out <laughs> So, okay. We have a builder's torch. Now, I kind of wish that you could, like, upgrade your lighting in the... Oh, he didn't jump. Yeah. I wish you could upgrade your lighting. Ha, ha I wish you could upgrade the lighting in the shop here, but... Apparently that's not a thing yet. So... Yeah, so you have to... You have to pick it up. Okay, you have to pick it up, turn it on, drop it. Okay, all right, we got it. Yeah, it's fine. So what should we do? I guess we should flip a car. Uh, because that seems to be the easiest way to make money. So let's go to the junkyard. Here we are, and... Ha! Okay. <laughs> How are you guys doing? I'm doing pretty good. It's hot. Again, it's very hot. So I apologize. I have the fan on in here. I couldn't take it anymore. Um, the long drive video the other day, I was about, I was about to die. So... I've got the fan on. I'm sorry if you can hear it while I'm talking, or if you can hear it in the background. I just, I don't, I really don't have another option right now. So that's what I'm doing. I guess we'll see just how good my, um, my background noise reduction filter is on my, uh, on my uh, thing there. So yeah. So anyways, we need a car to flip. Also, sorry for the plosive there. I, I accidentally popped a little, a little too hard on my peas. Okay, here's one of the new lot of wagons. That's very stylish. It's only fifteen hundred buckos. That would be an easy flip job, I think. Even though it's a little bit mangled up, might be able to fix it. I don't know. Uh, there is a wolf wagon, which I probably can't afford. Nope. All right. We got another truck, which is cheap. It's even got an engine in it. Look at that. Not much rust on it, though. What I'm looking for is the rustiest piece of crap I can find here. There's a little bit on this, but... Actually, it looks like there's probably more on here than there appears to be. Oh my god, $700? Are you insane? Yes, I'll take that. Holy crap. There's a lot of rust on this thing, too. That's 3200 bucks. Are you kidding me? $700? Hell yeah. I'm buying that, like, right the F now. Okay. Good, 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 good. We can make some money off of this, for sure. Boing. All right, let's tow this to the sign and hope that it doesn't freak out. 
Uh, and we'll take taxi to the garage now, not to my house. There we go. Hey, it worked. Look at that. Yes. Okay, well, first things first, let's clean it up and, and see what we're dealing with here. Oh, wow. Okay, that's not the color I was expecting it to be. Next question, too, is do I pop that uh, tow platform off, or should I just should I just do it the way it is? You know something I've always wanted in real life, not in the game. I could uh, I have it in the game, which is what reminded me. A well, first of all, a bigger garage. Who doesn't want that? Especially if you're a car guy or whatever. But um, I would love a garage that is set up that's first of all big enough and second of all set up so that you can you have the space to and the drains and all that stuff to actually wash a car inside I know that's a stupid thing to think about I hardly ever hand wash my cars. I, I hardly ever do that just because I don't really have a place to do it. The The closest thing I get to hand washing my cars is taking it to like the little, uh, you know, the little car washes where you, you know, put your money in the thing and you, and it has the hose and the brush and all that. And you, and you clean it off and in the little stalls, we call them miracle car washes around here. I have no idea what they're called anywhere else, but um, yeah, that's about it. Which works. It's not ideal, though. And, of course, costs, you know, money. <laughs> and there's always somebody waiting for you to be done so that they can come in and do it. So you can't, like, take your time. And you can't... They get pissed if you use a bucket and a sponge instead of using their their crappy brushes. And, you know, it's, it's a whole thing. I would love to be able to just wash my car in a garage and not have the weather beating down on me. And be able to, like, dry it off, like, in a shaded area... And, you know, if I'm going to do any kind of, like, wax or paint correction or anything like that, I can do that and not have to be in the blazing sun. Yes, that would be nice. I would probably wash my cars more often if I could do that. Okay, just jump up on... There we go. I think I bonked my head on the, the garage door. Oh, God. Okay. There we go. All right, she is clean. So how much did I buy this thing for? Like 750 bucks? Some ridiculous thing like that? Yes, all right, how much is it worth now? All right, 750 bucks, all right, okay. <laughs> yes, okay, so... Um, does this work? Can I do this? It does work. All right, let's put this... Uh, oh, God, let's put this... Um, can I, can I rotate this? No, it stays in the same grid position all the time forever. All right, let's put... Uh, the reason why I want to put some of my, my effing tools on here. To make things a little more efficient. Go figure. Yeah, yes. Yeah. So let's let's put one of these down here. That should make it easier to, to grab those suckers. Here we go. Alright, I'm gonna use the grinder, I think. Just because I have mentioned this before with a sandblaster, is that sometimes you don't know if you got everything or not. I was watching an episode of Scapegoat the other day where he was having a heck of a time getting all the rust off of a, a Lada. And I'm not saying if he would have done it with this, it would have been better. But see, like that, I know the hood is clean now. Because it popped like that. If I just went and just, you know, blasted away with the, with the sandblaster, I'd probably wouldn't know when it was all clean. Even if it looks obviously like it is, it doesn't mean it actually is. 
All right, so if I put my headlamp on, it doesn't really help. So let me grab this some um, biatch and... Oh, yeah, look at the light that thing puts out. Ooh, that's good. That's very good. I like that. Okay, so what I should do is I, I should probably get that other trolley and stick this thing on that. There we go. That's clean. It popped clean. That's what I want to see. So who knew that more light makes it easier to see? I'm just... Who knew that? Amazing. Amazing what we discovered today. Boom. You're clean. All right. Let's move back to this here. This is going to be a little bit of a nightmare to do. I haven't seen on this tow platform truck or on the um the box trucks yet i haven't seen the rust the rust um like pop clean on these on these panels yet um that doesn't mean that it doesn't do it i just haven't seen it yet so we'll maybe see if it happens this time around or not whoa Yes, this is working out quite well already. I really hope that thing doesn't take batteries or something, because... Uh, I don't know where one would get them, and I have not seen them yet, and I don't know how to change them, so... I guess we'll just see what happens. I'm dropping frames here, I don't know what's going on. The fan is keeping it a little bit cooler in here, so unfortunately, you guys are just going to have to deal with the fan fan stream for a while because I have no other way of keeping it cool in here. And my uh, my kid isn't going to homeschool co-op now because it's summertime, so. I can't just wait until they're gone, because now they're never gone. <laughs> oh, look at that. There's some under the uh, lip of this thing, too. Oh, you tricky little bastard. All right. At least this, this tow platform thing seems to be fairly easy to clear. The other truck beds are not easy. Looky there. Okay. What about under here? That looks good. Got some back here, though. Oh, well, there's that. All right, this is working pretty well. Oh, God. All right, there, here we go. Oh, see, it just popped clean. But that was just on the... It looks like just on the top rail. No? Maybe just this piece? I haven't really figured out, like, what the... What the mechanic of that happening actually is. Because this... Okay, that part's still there. This part is still here. Well, now that's gone. That's gone. See, this is much easier. Doink. Doink. Yes, I like this. Okay. <laughs> uh, I wonder if I'm going to have to take this off. I'm probably going to have to take this stupid thing off. I? There's probably some back here that I haven't seen. 
Yeah, there was some right there. I saw it. Crap. All right, well, plus I'm going to have to get to this. Ah, it's going to be a whole thing. All right, so... Yes, let's take Mr. Light here and look at... Look at all the stuff. I don't know. It might be clean back there. I might just... Uh, I might clean this bit off back here and just and just wing it. This one came back. What the hell? I don't want these things here anymore. All right, I'll use it as a stand for my light. How about that? Perfect. <laughs> All right. Please pick that up. Thank you. This is going to be tricky. I hope we're getting it. I think it's got. <laughs> Let's see what the machine says. Oh, God. There's still a bunch of rust on this thing. Where the heck is it? Oh, probably all this crap. Durr. All right, here we go. See this, I might need the, I definitely might need the, uh, the blaster for. Because this credit, trying to get in these little grill pieces is not easy. Yeah, I think instead of trying to mess with that, I'm going to. Okay, that looks kind of weird, but I think that's just dirt that's on that. No, no, no. Okay. Oh, look at all this. And we gotta gotta deal with that, I guess. Okay. Where else? Where else? That all looks good there. There's no fender over here. Can't grind that. Uh, let's pop this open here. Let's see. I can't grind any of that stuff. It's like there's some on the hood. And a really inconvenient... Oh, no, there's not. Okay. All right. I'm going to need the blaster for that. So let's get our blaster master. Oh yeah, took care of that. Lickety split. Yeah, I'm not gonna. I'm definitely not saying that the blaster is not easier because it is. It's just I feel like the grinder is more thorough. In that, when you see the panel just like come clean like that, you know that it's it's done. Uh, what we got? Oh, I see you. Here, see if I can do this. Got it. Yes. Okay, let's look at the other side here. All right. What do we got here? Anything under this? Ah, I don't see anything under there. I really don't want to take this thing off. Um, but I guess I will if I have to. Let's see what the machine says now. Better, but not fully there. All right, so where's the rest? It, it's got to be under that. It's got to be the... It's got to be the thing. What's the thing? Where's my wrench? There you are. All right, can I do this without lifting it up? Please say that I can. All right, there's that one. That one. That one. Do I have to take the gas tank out? I don't think I do for this. Uh, 
Ah, there we go. Look at that. Okay, do we have rust here? I don't see any. Oh, look at that. There's some on that inner lip all the way around the stupid thing. Okay, well, that's going to be fun to deal with. All right, let's finish washing this stuff off that I missed. All right. Uh, get that clean. Oh, God. Whoops. Oh, look at that. There's some right there. Too. You know what? I'm just going to leave this flipped up upside down like that. Screw it. Okay. Excellent. Right, let's clean this door. I guess there could be rust behind this door, but I don't think there's any other rust on this door anywhere. So usually if there's no rust on the door anywhere, then there won't be any behind the panel either. Usually. Okay, grinder, where are you at? Threw it on the floor instead of put it back where it belongs. All right, that's clean. <laughs> Is there any? Oh, yeah, there is right there. Look at that. Okay, that's clean. All right, so that lip appears to be clean. I don't think there's any more on this truck. So let's flip this thing back upside down or right side up. And. All right, this is going to be fun. All right. I thought that I saw it. There it is. There you are. Yeah, this is not going to work for that. All right. Um. Okay, let's put you back there. And we'll grab Mr. Sandblaster and come out here. And I can't use it anymore. It's broken. There we go. <laughs> we're just gonna ah, we're just gonna do this this whole lip real quick like. I don't think that needs it any right there. What about down? Yeah, I see some here too. Sneaky, sneaky. I'm also I'm wondering now if this is going to be utterly impossible to paint or if it'll be okay. I don't know. Okay, I think that's it. I think that's everything. Uh, yeah, wait a minute. Nope, there's some right there too. Damn. Well, this is fun. Okay. <laughs> no put you back there back over here turn you around put you right against the wall there stay there all right so what does the machine say it says it's worse now how does it get worse when i just removed all of it uh See, I don't want to put this back on. All right, what color is this stupid thing? 1B0604. 1B0604. One 1B0604. One 
I'll buy just go buy six of them. Why not? What the hell is that? All right. <laughs> Where did that come from? All right. Uh. All right, this is what I'm going to do. This is what I'm going to did. I'm going to paint this. And then stick it back on the truck. Is that rust right there? What the hell is that? What is all that crap? Is that rust? Here, let me get my big light here. My big boy light. What the heck is that? Looks like butt is what it is. All right. Um, all right, Mr. Sandblaster, you're coming back with me. Can I, can I just reach over here with it? All right. There's rust there now. It's not happy. Yeah, this is this is some of the weird paint in the game where the coverage is weird. <laughs> it just like doesn't seem to to work or something. I don't know. Looks like dirt there. It still doesn't look very good, does it? Hmm. Curious. Yeah, this is gonna be a. This is going to be an ordeal here to do this. I, get, I have a feeling. I am digging this light, though. It is, uh, is, is exactly what I needed. What the hell? Why? Okay, so this is why the grinder sucks sometimes, is because you have crap like that. Um, I don't know if that makes it a, a difference in the overall, like, color. But we're going to just give it a shot and see what happens. Yeah, at least the... the Coverage seems a little bit better. Yeah, this is weird. I'm kind of glad that this isn't a respray job because sometimes when you have these when you have these weird paints that um, that don't cover real well, that counts against you on the on the paint job. And you can never get it done. All right, that one's empty. Here, let's here, let's do this. Let's let's work smarter, not harder. Take Mister Box out here. Uh, I gotta run all the way over here to get the stupid paint, but that's okay. Whoops. All right. I still think this is going to be a pretty profitable job here. I can't believe that truck was so cheap. It even has at least at least part of an engine in it. Which is um, a little bit hard to believe. All right, this is going to be ass. This is going to be total ass to get this done. All right, we're getting it. We're getting it. What's the saying? Uh, inch by inch, it's a cinch. Yard by yard, it gets hard.
Most of that was already covered. That's weird that you got to paint like this little lip on the inside. <laughs> That's weird. Yes. Okay, I think this thing's good. Well, you know what? I probably got to flip it over. I'm sure that'll go well. Uh, yep. There we go. Excellent. What do we need to spray here? Oh, this one's out. All right, put you in there. It's like most of this got covered. Excellent. Okay, cool. Well, we'll skip that. Oh, I can't jump because of my... All right, let's stick. Let's, well, first of all, let's paint. Dear God. What the hell? Okay. Here I am talking about how great the grinder is, and it just made an absolute utter mess of this thing. <laughs> ah, okay. There. Are you happy now? Yeah, the, the, almost the entire cab of this thing is a different color. See, it looks like rust right there, too. That's just the paint being weird. All right. Okay, I can't see a damn thing. I need to get my light again. I freaking love this thing. I I don't know why I waited so long to, to use the light in this game, but holy crap. What an amazing difference. When I first saw it, I was like, oh, big-ass flashlight. Who cares? <laughs> this is great. <laughs> okay, we'll take my box of crap. We are almost out of paint. Hopefully I can finish this job. I'm not even going to care if the the color condition, the rust condition is perfect on this, because I'm going to definitely make money. So it's not really that big of a big of a deal. Let's see, does that panel get painted back there? I don't think it does. Nope, doesn't look like it. I don't think any of that does either. Okay. Uh. All right, she's empty. All right, last can. See if I can get it done here. I kind of feel like I need to buy two of those stupid lights now. <laughs> That way I don't have to keep moving it around, you know? Uh-oh. I appear to be stuck. Uh, there we go. 
All right, can I, is the roof of this thing painted the right color? Yeah, it appears to be. Is it, this paint looks like different colors from different angles. But not like on purpose. <laughs> All right, I think that's probably good. I think it's... There's still some weird splotches and stuff, but I think it's as good as it's going to get. So, stick the bed back on, or the tow platform, or whatever you want to call it. Boink. And, carefully, tighten. All right, what's she worth? 5,300 bucks, man. So I made like $4,500 off of this thing. Well, minus the cost of paint. And the, there's still rust on it somewhere. I don't know where it is, but I, I don't care. 5,300 bones, I'm not gonna complain. All right, let's turn this thing off just in case it runs out, I guess, I don't know. <laughs> um. I take my box of crap and dump it in there. Yeah, that worked. All right. I'm going to buy another one of those stupid torches. Watch me. That worked out really well. Is this store closed? I don't even know. Hello, he's still there. All right, so... So there's a regular flashlight as well, but I like I want this big SOB. Yeah, I'll take another one of those. Hey, uh, do you wear the same clothes every day, or do you have like a lot of the same matching set? What? I didn't hear what he said. <laughs> All right, look at me. I got two torches now. That makes me twice as bright. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh, hmm. All right. Oh, wait. Uh, you know what? I probably can't afford anything over here, but I'm going to look anyway, because because that one time I definitely made some pretty good bank off of buying a car in here and fixing it and selling it. It was worth a lot more than I thought it was going to be worth. I might as well take a drink while this is loading. There's another truck. I guess we're going to be a truck garage now. Oh, hi there. What are you? 3400 bucks. Overall condition, not good. Quite a bit of rust on here. Uh, broken windshield. Holy cow, this whole thing is... I could probably make a bit of money off of that, though. What about this thing? That's more than I can afford this oh is this uh jason it is indeed eleven thousand. look at this thing man muscle car it's even got it's even got an i6 in it muscle cars just ain't worth it all right i'm gonna buy this piece 3400 bucks give me it does it drive If this thing drives, it does, or at least it starts. <laughs> All right. Well, it doesn't drive great, but it does drive. At least it, we can get it into the uh, in the old garage here. There we go. Sweet. All right, let's see if we can work some magic on this thing here. How much was this thing? 3,500 bucks? Yeah, 3,500 bucks. All right, let's see what we can do here. It'd be nice to make at least three grand off of it. 
I feel like we probably can. First, we bang out all the dents. <laughs> That's all it's letting us do. Not sure what I'm banging here. I don't see much happening. That's what she said. <laughs> all right. Um. Oh, that fixed it right up. Look at that. Yeah, that's good as new. That apparently was the... Holy crime, Annette Lee. This thing is like... Completely wanged. Uh, there's no way this is going to bang straight. <laughs> no way. Well, that got a lot of it, though. Holy crap. I feel like the only way... This whole rear panel is probably going to have to be replaced, and this whole quarter back here, too. And that's probably not worth it. Um, yeah, I'm not seeing anything else here. Let's pop this open. Oh, the entire firewall is munched. Okay, I think I'm getting the hang of how this, like, hammering thing works here. Uh, yeah, I don't feel like replacing all that junk. It just doesn't really seem worth it to me. Same goes for this. I, I don't think there's much I can do for that. Aside from just cutting it all out and starting over. Which seems like a lot. Um, but we have some body fillers. Let's see what kind of magic we can work with this. Yes, very good. Most excellent. Well, let's go over here and get some more. <laughs> I do have body filler here, right? Yes. I will take these, please. Okay. <laughs> See, this is so much easier. I don't have to drive a stupid car all the way down to the stupid garage to get stuff. I can just... Just run down here and grab it. I love it. All right. Uh, there we go. Yes, spread it. Spread it everywhere. Just smear mud over this whole car. And we can paint it up and uh, get it the heck out of here. That's a lot of Bondo. All right. <laughs> Somehow these doors are straight. How does that happen? Oh, empty. Need another. All right. Yep, 
And that still doesn't look exactly right. <laughs> That's all it's going to let me fix. Oh, this door is not straight. Okay, well. Let's fix it. Wow, okay. We out of bondo again? Yes, we are. Another. <laughs> yeah, this car is going to be a lot of work just to get it in presentable condition. I, I I'm not. I don't think I'm going to go that far. I think I'm just going to do rust removal and paint. And, uh, and send it. So I did do that with that Jesse that one time, and it ended up um, making a pretty good difference, actually. Up oh, out again. <laughs> But I think with this car, it's not going to be worth enough, even in really, really good condition, to make it worthwhile. All right, let's see here. That's about all the Bondo I think I can spread on this thing. Which is enough. <sighs> okay, so let's do some rust removal. Thankfully, this is a color that makes it... Oh, okay. This is a color that makes it quite easy to see. Dang. I have a magic grinder now. All I gotta do is just touch things and everything comes immediately clean. Nope. Of course, that wouldn't happen on the rocker, which is the hardest place to remove remove rust. Yeah, look at that big old dent there. Nine times out of ten, it is definitely easier to just remove the rocker, fix it, paint it, and then slap it back on the car. But I've already started doing this, and I'm just going to keep doing it this way, I guess. Yeah, look at this. This is a mess. All right, did we get it? Oh, crap. All right, there's a bunch here. So is that rust? That's not rust. Okay. If there's if there's rust on this on, the, on this side of the panel, then there's almost always going to be some back here. Yep, there it is. All right, this is not fun. Yeah, we'll have to use the blaster to get that. All right. <sighs> Oh, we got a bunch behind this freaking door. Well, that's going to be fun. All right, well, I'll come back to that. Uh, this looks to be okay. Uh, what about over here? That looks to be okay. What's, what do we got going on here? It looks like there's a little bit right there. Let me grab that. Uh. All right. All right. 
Any more on the roof? I don't see any there. Is there any on the hood? No. Alright, so let's see. We need to get... Uh, we need to get this. And up in here. Just nuke that panel. We are out of sand. All right. Let's see if that works. I'm still going to remove that panel to paint it correctly, but I'm just curious if that'll get it. Okay. Is that all the rust? Let's look. Nope. <laughs> all right. Uh, uh, all right. Let's start. To, let's start pulling parts here and see what we can find. Oh yeah, look at that. Okay, there's definitely some there. That one looks good. So we'll stick that one back on. Actually, you know what? I'm just gonna leave it off because I gotta paint it anyway. All right. What about over here? Uh, that one's good that I don't have to paint it. So we'll stick that one back on. Yeah, same goes for that one. All right. Well, I don't know where the heck the rest of the rust is. Um, does this rocker look okay? Yeah, it does. Try to cheese my view here. Uh, oh, look at that. Where's that? Is that on the inside of this panel right here? That's kind of an unusual place for rust in this game. No, I think that's okay. Curious. Very curious. Okay, well, now it seems to be better. Um, just open. Okay, let me get rid of this and see, and see where that brings us. It's amazing how crappy these panels are. <laughs> it's bad. Real bad. I can't believe this was on the, um, this was in, like, the dealership. It wasn't even, like, the hell was going on there? All right. This this wasn't even, like, in the junkyard. This I feel like this is a junkyard car. It still shows there's rust somewhere. I don't know if I can be bothered. Doesn't just doesn't seem worth it. Uh, I'm not. Oh wait, where's where are you? Right there. Where the heck is that? It's on the inside of this stupid C B pillar. What? I have never seen rust there on these cars. See if that got it. Oh my god, get in the car. All right. That got it. Wow. All right. Let's see. Uh, let's see what the machine says now. 
Still not fully there, but I think I'm just going to paint this thing and send it because this thing is a wreck. Uh, 57B976. Wait a minute. Let's move this out of here. I don't even care what that is or what it's from. 57B976. 976. That looks right. All right, we'll get four cans of that and see if we can make some magic happen. This is the absolute definition of polishing a turd here. Like, this car is junk. <laughs> like, why they were selling it at the dealership? I mean, it does drive, I guess. So there's that, but man... Yeah, I guess uh if you're gonna if you're gonna buy a car from the from the little dealership there, don't just buy the first thing you see, you know. Of course, and I might I might end up making making some pretty good money off this. I don't know, but I have a feeling it's not gonna be a lot. And these jobs are, I mean, this one especially is not as quick as just doing a customer paint job, you know? Those are way faster, usually. That's if, it's, that's if everything works, right? <laughs> Sometimes you got those pain in the ass jobs that just don't work right. But... You know what? I never checked the uh, the front apron here to see if there was rust behind that. Doesn't appear to be. Okay. Oh crap! Yeah, I gotta paint that door. I got plenty of paint. I didn't need as much as I thought I was gonna need here. Look at that. That's rust. Look at all that. Shite. All right, here. And that's not getting rid of it either. Well, that's fun. What the hell is going on here with this? What the damn hell? <laughs> what about this? What the hell is all this crap? Is that... Yeah, this car is just junk, man. It's junk. Everything about it. Junk. I'm gonna just get it the hell out of here so I don't have to worry about it anymore. <laughs> we'll do a real project after this. Jeez. All right, is that? Whoops, forgot a spot there. Yep. Yeah, look at all this weird shit that's going on here. Like, I probably should just pull all these panels off and just replace them, but I'm not doing that. Spray paint the whole dash and everything. Screw it. Yeah, 
that little spot too that was bugging me all right uh Okay, all right, here, let's just stick these panels back on and see what we get. There's that. That. All right, let's get this crap out of here. What is it worth? 66.74. So I made almost 3,000. Which isn't bad. Not bad at all, actually. Considering how bad that car was, that's a deal. Man, someone give me six grand for that piece of crap? <laughs> like, yes. No take backs. Get it out of here. Um All right, let's do it. Let's do a customer job real quick, and then maybe we'll try to find our new race car. Because we need a new race car. The Neve is gone. And we have Races that need to be done, so I think we need to get a new car. Um, first of all, something is wrong with charging. Also, wait a minute. Hold on a minute. If it is in perfect condition, park it in the service area. I'll give you a quote. See, I was wondering if if it would, might make sense to take a uh, project car over there to sell. I don't want to do that. Windshield is not cleaning. Well, mine works just fine. Rust. Yes, take this job. Oops, sorry. I bonked the mic. 1,600 bones. All right, let's see how fast I can do this. What do we got? What is it? Oh, it's one of these. All right, and it's also one of those cool colors that you can't freaking see. Also, why did this thing end up over here? I... I wish you could lock this thing down so it doesn't move around all over the place. Oh, yes. I like this light setup. All right. Can I, can I do this? Yes. Oh, my God. This is fantastic. All of the light. All right. This thing has a lot of rust on it. A lot of rust. Get it? <laughs> all right. Uh... This is why I don't tell jokes, guys. I'm I'm terrible at it. There are many other YouTubers who are a lot funnier than I am. Trust me. Okay. This hood was pretty bad, huh? Man, it is so much easier to see. Normally, the you know, the cars that are this color are just such a bitch to do. Because you cannot see the rust. You cannot see it. Alright, see, I'm still having trouble seeing over here, but I got my little headlight for that, so... And that's clean. All right. So. I keep hitting the wrong button to turn on the headlight, too. It's very frustrating. <laughs> All right. We got some up here. Oh, well, not anymore. Oh, look at these friggin' rockers. Oh, for God's sakes. All right. I'm cutting them. Watch this. Okay, we're, we're going to do this the right way this time. Uh, as soon as I remember how to do it. <laughs> of course, I need another disc already. Okay. All right, got that right there. That's actually not bad at all. It's only, what, three, three cuts? Four? Yeah, this, this rocker is completely 
completely munted. Now, what about this stupid panel here that apparently has rust on it now? Yeah, this one looks fine on this car. I don't know why that last one was rusted. I've never seen that before. All right, let's do this other side because I have a feeling it's going to need it too. Actually, well, actually, that rocker's fine. It's just the doors that are screwed. All right, cool. This is easy. Um, should I do it with... Let's do it with this. So much faster. <laughs> Flip. And spray. Is it clean? Yes, much easier. All right, let's, uh, let's blast the rest of this car here. That door seems to be okay. This one seems to be okay. But it's the ones on the other side that are very much not okay. I feel like this job should be worth more than it is. This was a lot of work. Ah, I'm out of sand again. Rip. Okay, we need to take this door apart for sure. So let's do that. Ah, nope. Try again. There we go. Yes. Yep. Those doors aren't good. All right. That one appears to be clean. Nope. No, it's not. All right. What about you? Oh, was there actually none in there? Wow. Okay. Got lucky. All right, let's see what the uh let's see what the robot thinks about the rust condition of this car, right? Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh no. Knocked over my light. And we'll do x-ray vision here. Don't see anything. Oh, look at that. What the hell part is that? Is that on the... Uh... Oh, right there. That was sneaky. Did I get it? I did not even get it all. Apparently I can't get it from here. Um, did you see that? I gotta take the headliner out of this thing. No way. When did they start doing that? Okay, that's cool. Sure. Let's move these out of the way. Okay, see? Barrels, I'm trying to give you a chance here. I was just throwing you guys away, but I found a use for you. With your perfect thing to hold my light. So, as long as you cooperate, you can stick around. All right, so I need to take the headliner out of this thing. God, what a pain. I 
I think that's the only thing I need to remove to take it out. Yep. Okay. Wow, man. Look at that. And apparently I can't, I can't clear it. Oh God. All right. How does one go about getting rid of this? All right. That side got away just fine. Okay. Okay, well, this is very frustrating. <laughs> All right, let's see if the grinder can do it. I didn't put it back where it belongs. Now I can't find it. Funny how that works. Of course, the grinder hits it immediately. Wow, okay, that was a big deal. Um, it still says there's rust on this thing somewhere. Are you kidding me? There is no way. There's, oh God, look at that. Holy cow. Okay, so this is why customer jobs aren't worth it in this game. <laughs> Jeez. There was almost no part of this car that wasn't rusted. Does that count? Is that it? No, it doesn't count either. Oh, look at that. Okay. Holy cow. That has got to be it. There is no way there could be anything else rusted on this car. No way. It still says there's rust somewhere. Just, there's, there's nothing else. There's nothing else. See, it doesn't count that, so there's nothing there. I turn on my little headlight and look around. Uh, I I guess I'm gonna have to take those. Um oh, look at that. Uh, this has been a very complicated rust repair job. Dude. They are usually not this difficult. Okay, there there can't be anything else. Can't be. <laughs> what in the hell? <laughs> there's no way there's any more. There's no way. Ah. <sighs> Hello, where are you hiding, Rust? I right, there's there's not much of this car left. Like there's I've pulled. Alright, I've taken off these stupid B pillar trims.
Yeah, see, rust doesn't form on the insides of those. At least I don't think it does. I'm, I'm not seeing anything else. Do you guys see anything? I sure don't. I just don't understand. Unless it's not counting this because it's not it's not on the car right now. We've got all the doors. They're all clean. Uh, the only thing, there might be some behind these taillights. There's not. There's none behind the plate. Look at that right there. Ugh. Freaking sneaky. Oh my God. Why does that keep falling over? Like all of the sand went flying everywhere. Like, dude. Okay, is there any rust? There's still some somewhere. I'm calling BS. <laughs> Just, there's no way. I know I keep saying that, and I keep finding little spots, but like... Like, other than completely dismantling the entire car and searching every single part, like, sometimes there's some in these headlight buckets. I don't see any there. Couldn't see this one very well. See, that one's already... I've already blasted it. What is that? What is that? That's not rust, that's the dash, okay? Yeah, there is no more rust on this car. There is no way there's more rust on this car. Absolutely no way. Like, the only thing I can think of is that this rocker isn't completely clean. But it sure looks like it is. I'm just going to paint it and see what happens. Um, 0C0A16... Start with three because I don't know how 
how this is going to go here. Okay, let's do this first. So we can stick this back on the car. Get our welder it's over here. Of course, it needs an electrode because they always do. And I didn't bring the electrodes with me. Arr. Thank you. All right. Okay, there we are. There we go. So that's reattached. So does that, is that considered no more rust? There's still some somewhere. I'm going to have to give this one up because there's just, all right, let me take these doors apart. Even though there wasn't any rust on these before, if that's where it was, I'm going to be extremely upset. Yeah. See, I don't see anything on that one. And I don't see any on that one either. I'm kicking the sand all over the place. Here, you go through the wall. Thank you. All right. Um, No rust, no rust. What is that? That's rust right there. Didn't I, I just fix that? There's still rust somewhere. I don't see how it's possible. Look at that. Right there. That's not even a spot that I can get to. <sighs> oh, for God's sakes. Alright, how do I take the stupid seat out of this piece of crap? I go around there. All right, get out of here. And see, I still don't even see it. It's right there. Look at that. Sweet Jemima. All right. That's got to be it. There is no way there is more rust on this car. No way. I don't know what else to do, guys. I'm literally at a loss for words here.
There's got to be a glitch going on. That's, that's the only thing I can think of. There are no more panels to pull. I've looked through all of them. Yeah, I keep th thinking that piece is, is rust, but it's the dash. Ugh. One thing that kind of bugs me is the, the hood never, like, popped clean when I was using the grinder. So let me just blast it real quick. I mean, I'm just like, I'm just, you know, I, I don't know of anything else I can try. Um, okay, let's try the save and reload trick. That always works, right? All right, hold on just one second. Okay, we're back. There we go. That's what fixed it. Stupid freaking game. All right, let's get this piece of crap back together and get it the hell out of here. Unbelievable. Unfreaking believable. All right, paint. Where's my paint? Right here. This entire damn... Look at that. There's rust right there, and it didn't even count that. I don't care. You know what? Screw you. You're going to be a pain in my ass, You then I'm going to be a pain in your ass. Forgot how flashlights work. <laughs> I am really happy about these flashlights. Like, I don't know when they were added to the game, but um, yeah, they freaking work, man. They work. Paint. Let's just get this job done. Well, I really wanted to buy another project car this episode, but I don't know if that's going to happen now because. This stupid job took forever. What the hell is all that? I clean... What? <laughs> um... Oh my god. Yeah, this game has this game has some problems. I'm not gonna lie. Like what the hell is going on with that? I don't even care. I, I don't care. If if it says there's no rust, then I am sending it down the road. There's rust there too. Like, where did all this rust come from? All right, are those are those painted now? Looks like they are. Oh, missed a spot there. Okay. 
It'd be nice to get this done with these three cans. Here I am saying, oh yeah, customer jobs are way faster. Sure, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Not this time. Man. All right, is that everything? Holy cow, man. God. Yep, I had both of these pulled. Is that uh, Titan? Look how that rocker is completely rusted again. Like, I don't understand. All right, headliner. That almost fell through the world. That would have sucked. Rear view. There we go. Itch on my nose. Okay. Is it done? Can we get it out of here? Now the color condition's bad. Even though I have painted everything. Alright. Do I have to do something special here to make it... There we go. So now we have all of this is <clears throat> finally. Jeez. Yeah, that was not worth 1600 bucks. No freaking way. <sighs> all right. Well, I don't want this episode to end with a complete total bummer like that. So let's do one more thing real quick, even though it's late and this has been a long video. Let's go to the junkyard real quick and see what they got in here. They probably aren't going to have what I'm looking for, but we'll see. And no, it's not the Jason. I don't want to do another dumb muscle car. Um, I want to do something more interesting. So, so that's what I'm going to do. If, uh, well, assuming I can find one. Yes. Yeah, this game is uh, perfectly balanced and optimized. <laughs> Again, I whenever I say stuff like that, I am not dissing on the developer. I absolutely am not. You know, I'm I'm an IT guy. I've done plenty of programming in my life. Um, I do not have what it takes to program a game. Absolutely not. And I have have many, 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 many hours in this game, and most of them are pure enjoyment. Um, when crap like that happens, you know, I just chalk it up to being a bug, you know, and it and it happens. It's fine. Nobody's perfect. Okay, we got trucks. We got another Neve. Uh, multiple Neves. There's a Jason. No, that's a, uh, that's a Jesse. We got a Wolf Wagon. A Bart. They did not have what I wanted. Crap. All right, let's look at the, um, let's look at this place, even though I probably can't afford whatever they got. Here we go. Probably not going to have what I'm looking for. I'll, I might, if it's not in here, I might do like one more, one more day. And, uh, and just see what I can find. 
Yeah, so we've got a... What's this? A Chad? Or a Bart? That's a Bart. Yeah, Bart's the smaller one, right? We got a long bed truck. Yep, that's none of that stuff I want. So... Let's sleep off another day here. There we are. Junkyard. Take a look. Yep, I know this is not uh, the most riveting gameplay, but I at least want to try to... Uh, I was I was going to do, like, you know, this video, the, the plan of this video was to, like, unveil the new project car. Um, and I thought, oh, yeah, I'll just flip a couple of cars real quick and then buy the car, and the rest of the episode will be me tearing it apart. It was not, but that's okay. Sometimes things don't always turn out the way you want them. That's something I got to keep reminding my kid all the time. Uh, sometimes, sometimes life has other plans. <laughs> Even when it's something stupid, like what you're going to do in a video game for a, for a, um, for a video. <laughs> That's okay. All right, well, there's a convertible, but I don't know. I don't want a convertible. My question is... Can I buy one of these and put a hard top on it? I think that I can. Because we have two of them in the in the yard here. And I, I want the coupe. I want the coupe model. And eighty six hundred bucks. You want drugs? It's got a, com a mostly complete engine though, except the block is screwed. Good lord. And see, I, that's kind of a that's kind of a risk. I don't know that I can turn a convertible into a hardtop. That one doesn't have an engine at all. How much is this one? Almost six grand. Whew. All right, let's uh, go back to the garage. And we'll go over here one more time. Yes. This is uh, not a mechanic simulator. This is a loading screen simulator. Big difference. <laughs> All right. A lot of wagon. A lot of convertible. It's over here. A lot of sedan. Well, what to do? What to do? Um... All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna take a gamble here. I think this one it's got two good seats. <laughs> this one costs a lot more, um, but it has one good seat. Hardly any interior. Yeah, I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna take this. Right here. Give me it. Even though it's a lot of money. For a little car. I think everything on this one's mostly fixable. We'll put a new fender on that. Uh, the rest of it's pretty straight, I'd say. So. Tow it to... Customer sign and taxi back to the garage. There we go. There's our new car. Ta da! <laughs> and I want to see if I can if I can put a hard top on it. Um, not right now, but 
wolf body. Uh, so the doors are the same on the coop and the uh, convertible. Um, B pillar. Yeah, I'm thinking I can probably just. Yeah. See, there's the cabrio roof part. I think I can make this work. Yeah, I, I'm not a convertible fan. I think what I'm going to do is try to make this a coupe. That's what I'm going to do. And obviously it's not going to be that color. But this is our new project car, and it's going to be our race car. And we're going to win everything. All right. On that note, I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today and suffering through all of the nonsense that this game can give you sometimes. It's all part of the fun. <laughs> I hope you had a good time. I did too. And um, yeah, if you uh, usual YouTube stuff, you know, like and subscribe if you're not subscribed. And uh, you know, the channel keeps growing steady by steady, steady, steadily every day. So uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for all the support. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you on the next video. Take care.